Wi-Fi 7 is finally here. Kind of. What's up guys, <laughs> welcome back to the channel. Thank you for being here, I really appreciate it. The first Wi-Fi 7 demo happened recently and you probably didn't even know about it. A company called MediaTek performed this demonstration and this Wi-Fi 7 demonstration proves that Wi-Fi 7 is 2.4 times faster than Wi-Fi 6. Simply amazing. It's important to remember that this Wi-Fi 7 demo was done under optimal conditions and I'm looking forward to seeing a real world test. For instance, in a home or office or maybe an industrial complex. I wanna see a real test. Now there's a lot of new technology behind Wi-Fi 7 and we're gonna talk about that technology in this video. And MediaTek refers to Wi-Fi 7 as PhiLogic technology. And MediaTek's demonstration of the Wi-Fi 7 technology showcased super fast speeds and very low latency. And this demonstration proved that Wi-Fi 7 PhiLogic technology could achieve the maximum speed that has been defined by the 802.11BE standard. And this is the official name of the upcoming Wi-Fi 7 standard. Wi-Fi 7 will deliver 2.4 times faster speeds than Wi-Fi 6. And it will do this without using any extra antennas. And let's get real, could you possibly put any more antennas on that gaming router? Probably not. And to be honest, these new gaming routers are kind of looking scary. All those antennas look like some sort of weird creature out of an alien movie. And the lack of additional antennas is made possible due to the support of the 320 megahertz channels and 4K quadrature amplitude modulation. That's hard to say. According to the Wi-Fi Alliance, Wi-Fi 7 could provide speeds up to 30 gigabits per second or 40 gigabits per second or even more. And by comparison, Wi-Fi 6 provides speeds up to 9.6 gigabits per second. And Wi-Fi 5 lags behind at a measly 3.5 gigabits per second. And Wi-Fi 7 will be compatible with the 2.4 gigahertz, 5 gigahertz, and 6 gigahertz channels. And what makes Wi-Fi 7 the future of wireless technology is that it will support 8K video streaming, virtual reality, cloud gaming, as well as other various cloud applications. But let's talk about something really impressive with this technology. MediaTek's Wi-Fi 7 demonstration showcased MLO technology, which is multi-link operation. MLO technology essentially combines multiple channels on different frequency bands, which allows network traffic to operate without interruption, even if there's interference or congestion on the bands. That's some great technology. And MLO technology is a critical component for those who need a constant connection, like video streaming or gaming. While MediaTek did mention that Wi-Fi 7 products will come out in 2023, the 802.11BE standard is still in the draft stage and we're expecting it to be certified by 2024 by the IEEE. But MediaTek has stressed that the Wi-Fi 7 technology has worked from the inception, and these live demonstrations have proved it. And MediaTek's Wi-Fi 7 will be the backbone of home networks, office networks, and industrial networks, and will provide seamless connectivity from multiplayer applications to 4K cloud gaming, 4K calls, and 8K video streaming and beyond. What's amazing is Wi-Fi 6 is relatively new, and if you look at the price points for Wi-Fi 6 products, they're kind of expensive. Take for instance, a Netgear Orbi Mesh Wi-Fi system have models that range from $400 all the way to $1,500, depending on the model. And this Wi-Fi 6 technology is great. And you have to consider as well, many homes only have 100 megabits per second or 200 megabits per second download and upload speeds. So Wi-Fi 7 would not make sense for their situations. And millions of homes still have Wi-Fi 5. Sure, Wi-Fi 6 and Wi-Fi 7 will further stabilize and enhance Wi-Fi connections. But it is likely to be a few more years before we see Wi-Fi 7 as commonplace. And when Wi-Fi 7 comes out in 2023 or 2024, it will be expensive. And most likely businesses will buy these first. But I know when it comes out, I'm gonna get Wi-Fi 7 because I'm a home networking geek. And because you watch my channel, I know you're one too. And I look forward to Wi-Fi 7 coming out and I can't wait to get it. Let me know in the comments down below if you're gonna get it. And what are your thoughts on Wi-Fi 7? The technology does seem pretty amazing. And guys, once again, if you found this video helpful, please give a thumbs up and share it. And of course, hit subscribe to keep this channel alive. And I'll see you in the next video real soon. Peace.